Urusan TV udah agak aman ya, Om Jo ya. Tapi kalau urusan kira-kira uh, tadi kan WiFi belum di belum ada solusinya gitu kan Om Jo kan atau misalnya orang-orang yang emang sukanya nontonnya ya udah platformnya YouTube aja gitu. Berarti kan kuota internetnya terus kemudian juga menggunakan uh, data apa seluler uh, telepon seluler gitu kan. Ini kan hal-hal yang sebenarnya masa depan banget gitu. Kita coba akan bahas deh. Uh, Nitya akan undang untuk ngobrol-ngobrol bareng kita hari ini. I would like to invite uh, Mr. Vikram Sinha, President Director and CEO Indosato Radio Hutchison. Oh, congratulations. Selamat dulu nih. Aku mau mengucapkan selamat sudah merger. Dua company sudah gabung. Sekarang jadi namanya, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, namanya menjadi Indosat Uridu Hutchison. Is that correct? Sudah benar? Karik, karik. Perfect, karik. Oke, selamat karena sudah sudah bergabung antara dua perusahaan. Harapannya sih banyak. The expectation, I think, uh, I think will come from uh, many of the customers of the merger of the two companies. I think it's there's a big expectation there, gitu. But first of all, uh, boleh kasih tahu saya. Could you tell me how did it go? Uh, uh, first of all. Uh, uh, Thanks, Nitya. Uh, uh, you know, I, I think I am personally very honored and humbled to be given this opportunity to lead Indosat Uridu Hutchison family. You know, uh, Indosat is the anchor. Uh, let me put it this way. And, and Indosat is bringing Uridu and Hutchison together. We are very mindful of the purpose with which we will be working. You know, the purpose is larger than life mm. because we all know the role and importance of telecom sector and companies Indeed. like Indosat after COVID, especially after COVID, Nitya, you have to understand, you know, and then with the larger scale, with, with the, you know, objective of being bigger, bolder and better, uh, we believe that uh, this will be a game changer for the industry itself. And then we'll be able to contribute much more for the uh, bigger purpose of connecting every Indonesian. Hmm. It's, it's very interesting that you mentioned uh, you're hoping that it could be a game changer. What kind of game changer that you're talking about? Are we seeing uh, new stuff, new coverage, new... Can, can you tell me? No? Is that, is yes, that a spoiler? Yes. <laughs> no, I, I think... Uh, look, uh, uh, let me set the context. Uh, telecom sector had lost a bit of a steam, you know, and all the all the limelight was taken by OTTs and Googles and the Facebooks of the world. But COVID, for me, the way I look at it has been a silver lining. All of us, policymaker, government, they have seen the role which we are playing, you know. Mm-hmm. With this scale, with this scale, you know, uh, with, with uh, two strong shareholders uh, coming together, uh, we will have the financial strength we will have what we need to do for the customer you know not only in big cities uh, it will help us go to smaller villages yeah. give them the kind of uh, network needed because this is this is what is enabling the digital indonesia you know we need to make sure that uh, digital divide is not there to do all those things one person cannot do it alone you need strong number two, two who can work two heads are better than direction. one yeah Yes, yes. <laughs> so you're talking about the cost efficiency. You're talking about uh, build something uh, stronger and, and, and better than uh, each of the company could ever imagine to do uh, by themselves. But what are the benefits? The benefits for the customers are really important. Uh, yes, you are absolutely right. At the end of the day, for a customer, what matters is how do we improve exactly. their experience? So for customer, you know, uh, uh, we will, will they will see how the experience, especially the indoor coverage experience, is improving, and then mm-hmm. how we are able to come up with more, you know, digital services. Uh-huh. Within two weeks of getting born, we were able to launch a digital loan product, which is UCAN in partnership with uh, QNB Indonesia. You know, we have to walk the talk. You know, we can't be doing headline that we want to be digital. We want to be most preferred. Now time has come that the customer look for action. We will have the financial strength to demonstrate those things, you know, uh, and then this is how it will benefit because the two uh, asset of these two companies is very complementary. When we bring all the physical sites, when we load them with all these spectrums which we have, the all benefit will go to customers. Okay. Uh, 
so can you enlighten me again about the purpose? I mean, uh, the merger of the uh, two companies, obviously, uh, you know, to, to become stronger, to give more, a better service. But do you have any specific purpose that will, you know, make things uh, better for the customers? You know, uh, excites me, and this is what excites all IOH employees, you know, uh, the purpose. And the purpose is very meaningful, you know. We all know uh, Indonesia will be the digital powerhouse in Southeast Asia. Mm -hmm. All research, everything support. We want to play an enabler role by, you know, uh, making sure we are helping connect every Indonesian for this larger purpose. And that, that, that gives us a lot of excitement and that gives us a lot of motivation. And, and when we come together, we are much stronger, you know, when you look at our customer base, when you look at our financial leverage, when you look at support from shareholder. So this, this purpose which we have, uh, you know, which, which will help us make sure that we are fully committed. You know, uh, when you have a purpose like this, it really helps you galvanize your team. You know, we all know I that see. we are working for a larger purpose of supporting uh, Indonesia on their digital vision. It, mm. is, it is larger than life. We feel proud that we are playing a very, very important role. And we all know uh, the importance of, of uh, Indonesia being the digital powerhouse. And, and being a part of it is very meaningful for us. Exactly, larger than life. I really, really like that, that sentence of uh, yours, saying that uh, connection is very important. So uh, as many as uh, the company can reach, I think it's going to be better, uh, better. You know, more customers could get a better service. So I really want to talk about the service. I really want to talk about, uh, you know, each company before the, the merger has its own segmentations, has its own characteristics, has its own thing. If, if I could say a, a thing. Uh, how, how, could you, how could you make sure that each of the company's value is still there, that is very cherished by the, the, the customers, but you can also reach more than each of the company has, uh, has before? Uh, good, good question, Nitya. You know, uh, we are very mindful that we are bringing two different culture, very unique culture together. And, 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 and this is what, uh, you know, is important. How do we get the best of both? Yes, exactly. You know, uh, and, and, and how do we make sure? This is also an opportunity to set a new culture. You know, what, what we want and, and what our customer want. Mm -hmm. So we have two brands now, IM3 and 3. Both yeah. of them are very complementary. If you look at 3 brand, you know, when it comes to gamer, they are known for their latency. They are one of the best. IM3 has a little bigger market segment you know it's kind of a family it has youth also it has family wife everyone so now with these two brand you know we'll be able to take it to next level but our guiding principle is very clear we want to keep things very simple and transparent we want to keep listening to our customer and we want to make sure that we deliver what they want so this is how we will take it forward Okay, I want to talk deeper about uh, more technical uh, issues. Like if you if you said that uh, both of the customers could get, um, you know, they don't have to worry about a thing. But what about the technical issues? Do they have to to you know get a new card and etc. But but can we talk about this uh, later on? I just have to take a quick sip. I think you need a coffee too. It's, <laughs> it's still is on a working hour. I think we have to t uh, talk about this more and getting deeper for the customer's uh, base interest. We're, we're gonna uh, be back after this one. Sure, Nitya. Thank you. Thank you. This is the mantra. You know, you have to keep things simple, transparent, hassle-free for them mm -hmm. and keep improving and give them good experience. Before I go back to Vikram, uh, uh, we, we have our, 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 our senior uh, here. <laughs> we have Mr. Joe here. <laughs> well, Mr. Joe is, is more Hi. of the premium uh, customer's uh, segmentation. Uh, Om Joe, yeah. what are your concerns? Kalau bicara soal 
apa namanya mobile data gitu soal internet kebutuhan apa yang paling jadi uh, main concernsnya Om Jo kebutuhan Om Jo sebagai customers itu apa? Uh, wifi penting, gitu. jaringan jaringan internet yang bisa diakses yang cepat gitu ya? ya uh. Oke okay. so fast uh, fast connections oke okay. and then mm. uh, setelah itu apa? Uh, the price maybe harga? Iya yeah, harga yang terjangkau oleh semua kalangan. Tapi terjangkau itu kan it's it's very uh, subjective ya. Uh, ya <laughs> seperti kita tahu dimensi. sekarang masyarakat Indonesia seperti uh, jangkauan masyarakat bawah itu kan 100 sampai 200 gitu kan kira-kira. Uh, 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 ya kisaran itu. Oke, okay, so uh, so I uh, I take it as a worth it ya. Yeah? So, uh, harganya tuh masuk di akal gitu. Oh, what do you think Vikram? We have a we have a customer here. <laughs> do you think you can answer for him that his worries are me nothing? I mean like the, the after the merger of the two companies, he doesn't have to worry about all those kind of uh, price and uh, any kind of technical issues. Yes, Anitya, you know, I I I I I I heard you talking to Om Joe and 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 I, I, I look, uh, you know, uh, our our customer uh, like Home uh, Joe, uh, they are looking for value for money. They are looking for experience mm -hmm. because you know today uh, uh, the the connectivity and and the experience goes hand in hand. We are doing this uh, uh, meeting. If the network is not good, it doesn't work. So so please understand how important it is. Yeah. So so we will make sure that we live up to our customers expectation by delivering superior experience this is this is the mantra you know you have to keep things simple transparent hassle free for them mm -hmm. and keep improving and give them good experience good speed good latency wherever they are if they are in their home if they are in their office if they are in their you know study room Out doing outdoor activities go. because yes. you're saying then all yes. uh, yeah each each of the each of the uh, previous brand is also accommodating for those uh, younger generations they want to go outside they want to have a stable connections they want to send things and uh, you know repost things and receive things in a speed of light they don't want to any you know uh, delayed okay so do you think that that it's it's not going to be a problem so you uh, you're saying that because of this merger there will be no worries about uh, you know those technical issues like do i have to do i have to get a new card uh, do i have to pay more no look let me put it this way uh, you know uh, we we are very focused that for customer it is hassle free only it has to improve for them in terms of customer experience and how will that happen you know we are just a month old company now, IOH was formed on 4th January. We are starting our integration process. Okay. So, you know, in, in next six to nine months, they will start seeing that their indoor coverage experience, their indoor experience, if they are watching YouTube in their bedroom also, mm -hmm. they will be having some better because we will have more number of physical sites. When you look exactly. at both the companies, you know, Indosat or Edu had around 28,000, uh, Hutchison 3, H3 had around 32. So today we have 60,000 plus physical sites. If I remove duplicate site also, still it will be somewhere around 45 or 50,000. Mm. So, you know, you have the advantage, both the brand has the advantage of 50,000 physical sites. Both the brand will have over a period of one year advantage of all the spectrum, 900, 1800, 2100. What does that mean? You know, they will get better experience, but they don't have to do anything now. If we okay. want them to enjoy. Yes. In fact, in fact, the first month offer was we have a bigger family of close to 100 million. The you can call among each other free. Don't have to worry. Mm. No star mark because we don't believe in any you know T's and C's. We want to be very transparent. Uh, so this is how it will start. But the important point I want to highlight that customer is asking for better experience. Exactly. No more cheap product. You know, it is not about the prices in Indonesia is already rock bottom. Mm. And, 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 you know, we have to get ready for 4G better and we have to get ready for 5G. 5G. So, so, so prices has to be more value for money. You know, it's no more, you know, 
a service which is not reliable, cheap product, uh, customer is not looking for such things. Yeah. Well, the thing about having a good connection um, in your mobile phone while you're, you know, we're still having pandemic right now. Uh, it's it's very important to have a good connection wherever you are. You might be stuck in your home, uh, doing homework, or you you know those kind of. It might seem like a small things, but if you get uh, if it gets better, I think the the more experience that the customers uh, will get during this pandemic, of uh, especially. You are absolutely right. We are not out of pandemic, you know, and and, and we have to make sure that uh, we keep supporting all our customer on on their daily needs, on 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 whatever they are doing, and and this is very important. And I keep repeating myself. The role of companies like Indosat post pandemic and we are continue to build on it is becoming very important and, and we are very mindful of that and we will make sure that we focus on giving the best experience to our customer. Okay, so uh, you're saying that in nine to, uh, sorry, in six to nine months, uh, we're, you're, you're still approaching to to get more information for the customers and stuff, but could you tell me again um, how the uh, Indosat Uridu Hutchinson's, you know, what kind of strategy that you have for the future? I mean, we're talking about long term here. We're talking about, you know, you, you mentioned it by the 5G, but I think I think the future is beyond that. We're having metaverse right now, so it's it's very exciting. Yes, uh, and 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 and. Uh, I, I, I'll come back to my purpose, you know, if, if Indonesia has to be the digital powerhouse and it will be not only in Southeast Asia, it will be one among the world, Indosat will play a very important role uh, by ensuring that, you know, you have the basic things of very stable connectivity, mm -hmm. then through our scale, we will have right partnership collaboration to bring all the digital services and products. So I spoke about UCAM. Today, UMKM, you know, supporting SME is very important for Indonesia to do well. Uh, you know, uh, small and medium enterprise has to be supported. And, and we have started our journey on, on that front. We will work with other partners like Google, Facebook, and all to bring uh, the right digital services which is needed by all segment of our customer. And that is only possible if you have the scale. Yeah. You know, uh, Indonesia is a big country. And when you are trying to attract uh, the right partner, they look for scale and they look for agility. So this is how we are starting now. But uh, the important point to note is that, uh, you know, uh, uh, once we are starting getting ready for 5G, uh, again, you know, uh, we have to learn from our past. What do customers want? It is mm -hmm. not only a speed game, it is much more. Yeah. How we can help them on their daily challenges, how we can make sure that we are part of their uh, journey, uh, not only as a connectivity partner, but much more. So these are the uh, things which we are working on a long-term basis. But I, I will repeat myself, uh, this this transaction itself is a landmark deal for Indonesia as a country because it helps the sector become more healthy. The spectrums are getting used in a more efficient manner. Nitya, please understand spectrum is like a national resource. So it is important, it benefits customer, you know, so it, it will be more efficiently used. Uh, and, and then, you know, uh, also the kind of product and services needed in, in the rural, all those scale, uh, we will be able to deliver and, and it will help everyone. It will help our customer, it will help our shareholder and for employees also, you know, mm -hmm. uh, we will, we, we are working with a growth mindset. We want to make sure that we maximize and, and we have been talking to our employees that this is a lifetime opportunity given to all of us. Let's, let's live to it and do our best. You know, this is how we are starting our journey. All the best for you and the team. Uh, I expect greatness. I expect more experience for the customers. I think it's going to be an, an interesting experience. So uh, again, congratulations for the merger. I'm hoping to see more from the uh, new 
<laughs> and I, I can say that it is, this is very, very exciting to see uh, what, will, what kind of benefits that you will give to the customers. Thank you very much, Vikram, for joining us today. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Nitya. Thank terima you. kasih. Terima kasih. I hope, terima I hope kasih. you well. Uh, I hope you well. Mudah-mudahan semuanya dalam kondisi sehat. Uh, I would leave the last sentence to our one and only Om Jo. Thank you again. Awalnya manusia gambar di dinding-dinding gua Seperti di layang-layang maros Bercerita pengalaman hidup mereka Berburu, diburu, kawin dan beranak cucu Lantas berkomunikasi dengan bunyi Mengabarkan isyarat ke tempat-tempat jauh Dengan trompet, kentongan, gong dan tambur Serta asap yang membubung tinggi oh. Bangsa Cina lantas menemukan kertas Tradisi baca tulis pun dimulai Setelahnya mesin cetak muncul Mesin analitik pun menyusul oh, oh, oh. Dunia bergerak cepat Teknologi melaju Secepat kilat Telegram, kode morse Film dan telepon Pita penyimpan Magnetis dan televisi Hipertext, komputer, transistor Jaringan komputer, email, internet Sebentar lagi metaverse oh, 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 Waktu, waktu melaju selalu Kau dan aku 